just look at a scenario where the Supreme Court says, yes, he has that. He has all those rights. He is immune from everything. Yeah. You know what Joe Biden could do since he is presently president? What? Whoa. <laughs> he could throw every Republican in jail. Whoopi Goldberg has just gone crazy. This is the craziest thing I've ever heard her say by far. This video is brought to you by TatumStore.com. TatumStore.com. Get the merch link in the description section. Put in discount code ANSWER20. Get 20% off the entire store. Like and subscribe to the channel. Hit the bell so you get a notification anytime I go live and make a video. Make sure you're still subscribed to this channel. Like this video. Comment on this video. Share this video. Let's get into this. Ladies and gentlemen, gentlemen and ladies, this is the crazy, like, she finally said the quiet thing out loud. This is the craziest thing I've ever heard. Not only is the craziest, it's the stupidest, and it's also untrue. Whoopi Goldberg should be ashamed of herself for what she said in this video. And I don't want to hear nothing about anybody saying that there's Republicans on the view. It does not exist. It is insane to me that these women will talk over other people, yell them out of the room. Whoopi ran off the stage one time. I, don't, I forgot who she brought on. She ran off the stage. Judge Jeanine Pirro. She ran off the stage of the back cussing and acting a fool. And she said something this ridiculous, and not one person checked her on it. Not one person on the, not the Republicans, nobody checked her on what she just said, which was crazy ridiculous. No, don't, don't listen to me. Roll the clip. Well, the Supreme Court won't hear oral arguments until the end of April. Now, I just, you know, just let's look at a scenario where the Supreme Court says, yes, he has that. He has all those rights. He is immune from everything. Yeah. You know what Joe Biden could do since he is presently president? What? Whoa. <laughs> he could throw every Republican in jail. How, 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 was she reading off a piece of paper? So I, I'm hoping to God somebody didn't slip and, and the bag of crack fell down their throat and they were hot when they wrote this. How, what, what? He could put every Republican in jail. What does that even mean? The president do not have the authority to arrest people. Is she saying he can do it through nefarious means at the you know at the executive branch? Is that what she's saying? She can he can use the FBI or something? Personally, he cannot make an arrest. What does that even mean? You got to go through court. You can't just say you go to jail because I feel like it. You have to go through court. If the federal government has a court. Yeah. I yeah. mean, he could. I mean, no, Actually, no, no. Why? This is not because a good thing. Totally because he'd have totally, he could yeah. go. He, what this means. This. Dang, these women are stupid. Even the dummy over here, the wasted face. She's talking because he has total immunity. Total immunity does not mean you can commit crimes. The immunity that they're referring to regarding Donald Trump is that he's immune to the he's immune with the First Amendment exception, which means that he could say what he wants to say about the election. And you can't use that as a, a way that he's coercing the outcome because the president has an opinion about an election. You can't use his words to say he's then coercing because then he wouldn't necessarily have the freedom to actually speak his mind. Then we will be suppressing a president that may have knowledge of truth that he can put out to the world while he's acting president. Total immunity is not a thing. And she's dumb. Both of these women are dumb because just say he had immunity like Whoopi is saying. He still don't have the pathway and authority to put anybody in the jail. Who, who's going to arrest him? Biden? Come on, man. What, what, are, you, what are you even talking about? <laughs> Immunity would be he he went through a nefarious means to get Donald Trump put into jail illegally, and he was absolved once they caught him. It, it, that's got to be what she's saying. Anyway. Is it's, uh -huh. He could do anything. Yeah. He could dismiss everybody's debt. Yeah. No, he can't. Supreme Court already ruled that that's unconstitutional. You know, there's a whole bunch of great stuff that could happen, but let's, let's really look at what this means. And get rid of people's debt, that's not a great thing. That's stupid. That is stupid. 
Yeah. So, if, that, so they're basically mm? kicking the can down the road, though. They, they're not taking up this case immediately. Right. So what's right. their motivation, then? If, they, if we all know that we, they can't do what you just said because right. of the extreme power that a president would have, right. what is their p motivation for not doing it right away? Well, unfortunately, some people are saying the motivation <coughs> is that there are certain conservative justices that have been appointed by Trump that want to help him. And because we know the end result is if this case is not resolved by the time uh, of the election and he, God forbid, becomes the president of the United States, poo -poo. The, the Justice Department policy is that you cannot indict nor put on trial a sitting president, right? And so it's his get out of he jail. He could throw him in jail. It's, but it's his get out of jail free card. No, no, I'm saying Biden could throw yeah, See, they, they, Biden this could is a that. slippery slope does, because what, if they if they give him this immunity, but I, what's good for the goose is good for the What I also will say Biden. is they're, yeah. they're listening to these arguments in April. The end of their term is in June, right? Oh, right. They return again, in, I believe, in October. The Bush v. Gore case happened real quick. Mm -hmm. Do you remember well, that? They know how to do, know how to do this. how to work real yeah. fast. That was the day democracy died. These people are crazy, man. I'm sorry I cut the clip. Put it right in the comment section. Would you rather me just play the clip through once and then do commentary or, or like break it up as it goes? I don't know. I like to talk through it, but maybe that's not the way people like to watch it. But I mean, these women are, 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 are just, and it's not just because they're women. They just so happen to be women. They're nuts. You can't, like, these are adults. These women got to be in her 60s. She, Whoopi got to be 60-something. These women got to be old enough to know better than what they're saying. You can't make a statement after you didn't wrote notes and stuff saying that the president can put somebody in jail. Biden cannot order somebody to go to jail. Even if he had immunity, he still, what, what means does he have to actually accomplish that? He cannot order the FBI to jail somebody with no charges. In this country, you're innocent and proven guilty. You can't go to jail without, being, without going through trial and being convicted. That, that's the way jail works. You can't say, listen, go get him and put him over there. It don't work like that. Now, are you saying, which I noticed what he's doing now, which she, the quiet thing out loud, is manipulating the, the judicial, I mean, the executive branch to do a false investigation into somebody to get them arrested. That's what she's really saying. And immunity will say once they catch Biden from doing it, he's immune. But that's not the same immunity. And I hope that the Supreme Court justice is actually protecting Donald Trump. I'm okay with that. I'm all right with it. Because if they had power, they'll be doing it. Uh, look at Hillary Clinton. Should have been in prison to the day I die, I'm going to say, at, at my funeral. Whoever's doing my eulogy, eulogy at my funeral, I want them to say Hillary Clinton should be in prison. And then they can go on and talk about my life and, and the things that I've done. Hillary should be in prison. They didn't send her to prison. Everybody in their mama knows she should have went to prison. Joe Biden, his son, doing so much cor corrupt stuff in Ukraine, we know they should be in prison. They should be going to jail. So if you're not going to put them in jail, then you can't put Trump in jail. And if y'all not going to be fair in the Supreme Court, then let the Republicans run the Supreme Court. I, I don't hope nobody die, but I just wish that we get more spots in the Supreme Court. I'm hoping that, I'm hoping that we outlive them and get more positions in the Supreme Court. And we really need Trump in there because I think Clarence, I think Clarence Thomas is looking to retire. And I feel like if Donald Trump get in there, Clarence will retire. We can put a brand new young Republican in. If Clarence Thomas is going to have to try to outlive another president, if, if somehow we get a Democrat back in there, I'm telling you. And I would argue that I think Clarence and maybe one other person is about to time out in the next 20 years. And so they're going to need fresh bodies to keep Republicans in there. And, and I hope to God that one of them go out while we have a Republican office. Then we can get another conservative on the Supreme Court. That's what we should have our whole Supreme Court be conservative. That would be the greatest thing to ever happen on planet Earth to this country, in my opinion. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I said enough. These women are crazier than five left shoes on an eight-legged man. Comment in the comment section. See you on the next one. I'm out. Thank you guys for watching the video. If you enjoy my content, I guarantee you, you will enjoy Tatum Plus. Brand new platform that we just launched. Exclusive content, behind the scenes of speaking engagements, all the stuff you can't see on all of my social media platform. We'll always have free content, but the extra stuff for people that really love my content will be on Tatum Plus. So go join Tatum Plus today.